Vespius and the Adorix returning back on the deck to summon the Gladiator Beast Tamer Editor to summon the Domiti Anus. Domiti Anus will negate a monster effect during the opponent's turn. And we have Samorg. Samorg is in this deck? What the heck? During the end phase, summon a monster from the deck. Bro. There can only be one winner. And you're looking at it. Let's go. Gladiator Beast. Let's do it. We're going first with Gladiators. Back in my day, I love me my Gladiators. It was all about the Geyseris. We're going to Rescue Rabbit, Banish Summon 2, Andals onto the field, triggering the rejection to special summon our Vespicito. Vespicito is here. Test Tiger and the Andal are going to link off into the Test Panther. I know about Test Tiger, but Test Panther... Test Panther searching for the Gladiator Beast Comeback. Comeback will special summon a Gladiator from your hand or graveyard with a different type than what you control. We're going to fuse into the Gladiator Beast Domiti Anus. What the heck? Let's read all these real quick. Gladiator Beast Tamer Editor. Must first be special summoned for the extra by shuffling, blah, blah, blah. What this card does is once per turn, you can special summon a Gladiator Fusion from your extra deck, which is the Domiti Anus. Domiti Anus has been summoned. This has the quick effect of when your opponent activates a monster effect, you can negate. Get negated. Let's go. Link off into a link three unicorn. Why? Why? Why unicorn? Unicorn? Okay. We're going to use the comeback. Comeback special summon. Oh, is this once per turn? You get it in the graveyard, then resummon it, and then use its effect again? This is once per turn special summon a gladiator beast fusion from your extra deck. What? I didn't know gladiators could do this. This is why we're doing this. Oh my Jesus, the OG negator. I love this. We have Apollo USA, double monster negate after gains the attack, and the Heraclinos. This will discard a card to negate a spell or trap. Once per turn? No. It will negate per card you have to discard. Negate, negate, negate. Before the freaking Heralds were out, we had Heraclinos negating. Nuts. We have double spell and trap card negate, double monster negate, and we have Domiti Anus negate. Bro, you didn't negate Allure Darkness? Negate that. <laughs> Thank you. What the heck? Negate Black Whirlwind. We got Black Wings versus Gladiators. What is this? 2000 freaking 10? Negate. Negate again. Double. Negate. I don't think so, mate. We still have triple monster negate. What the heck is that? Alistair the... Alistair. Alistair the South Wind. Apollo USA. Negate. Okay. And I guess you just instant win with gladiators. What? All right. What about going second with gladiators? Bestiari, Geyseris popping. Oh, crap. Against a Grassland Screener Skull Servant deck. You got to be freaking kidding me. Activating all the cards that were sent to the graveyard. We're going to have a zombie world in the field. Everything's going to turn into zombie on the field and in the grave. We're going to need Domiti Anus to get out of this situation. We cannot tribute except for zombie monsters. Doom King will negate a monster and or banish a monster on the field or in the graveyard, but only after a zombie effect is activated. But the zombie world turns all your monsters into zombies. So this looks like instant win zombie skull servant. How can Gladiator Beast break this field? It's not possible. 5,000 attack King of the Skull Servants. Okay. Quite the field. We have the negate. Cosmic Cyclone does not go for the zombie world. Do you not know what this does? This is comboing with the Doom King to negate and banish you. What are you doing? You just banished a dead card. Grass that looks greener. What the? We're going to summon another Doom King. Maybe he's a Chad. Maybe he knows what he's doing. Dark Ruler no more. The entire field is negated. Completely negated. And you can't chain to it. We're going to special summon the Test Tiger with the Bestiari. And we're going to make a Test Panther, not a Geyseris. Okay, Gladiators have changed a lot since back in my day. Don't try to negate, mate. You are negated. 
The Dark Ruler No More is like paying a full cost for your droplet, but it's not a quick effect, so you can't set it, you can't chain to a monster. That's why a lot of people prefer the droplet, but the droplet does cost cards to discard. You have Test Panther summoning a Darius. Darius will summon Bestiari. Bestiari can activate to pop a card in the field, but it is negated. Trying to pop the zombie world. Are you crazy? Guy Zeris wiping out two. That's what I know that you do. Guy Zeris back in my day. Bestiari plus another gladiator pop two. Also, it can go to battle and then summon two gladiators from the deck. Take out the Doom King. You take no battle damage this turn due to the Dark Ruler no more. A quest, add a gladiator in the graveyard back to the hand. And what? What is this one? I have not seen this one. Whoa. Oh my Jesus. What the hell? Oh, uh, Adorix? I, I mean, uh, I'm not into that. Sending a gladiator from the deck to the graveyard. The uh, quest is going to add the comeback. Gladiator Beast comeback. As it says in the name, your gladiator comes back. Come back from the grave. Vespius and the Adorix returning back on the deck to summon the Gladiator Beast Tamer Editor to summon the Domiti Anus. Domiti Anus will negate a monster effect during the opponent's turn. And we have Samorg? Samorg is in this deck? What the heck? During the end phase, summon a monster from the deck. Bro, now he can't special summon except wind type monsters, and you're going to negate a monster effect. Activating the zombie Necronize, which is going to be returning a Skull Servant back to the hand. Okay. Domitianus was just activated right there. What was what effect did you apply right there? When your opponent activates a monster effect, that's great. Okay. The, you could choose the attack targets for your opponent's attacks? What? You chose for this 7,000 attack to attack the Samorg. I did not know that the Domiti Anus could choose attack targets. Okay. Bro, completely protecting the barrier statue from attacks. He can't special summon and he cannot attack into it. Gladiator Beast, proving ground, searching for a Bestiari. Bestiari with the barrier statue is going to make what? A wind charmer. Summon a wind from your opponent's graveyard. The editor's gonna summon a Geyseris and get the full pop, wiping out the monster and the back row. To battle, we go. Editor, wipe out the fool. Take out the lady in white and 3,500 damage from the Domitianus. We are negating every single turn. Negate a monster effect and choosing the monster's attacks. Darius summon a monster from the graveyard onto the field. The quest is negated. Don't cheat, mate. Hey, stop that. Vespacito is boosting up the entire field. The editor is returning itself back into the extra to summon an Augustus. We're going to then resummon the Gladiator Beast Tamus, which is two level five or higher gladiators to summon. That's going to summon a Heraclinos. Heraclinos will be a spell and trap negate per card we have in the hand to negate. So we have spell and trap card negate. We have monster negate and choose the attack targets, mate. What's left? Mizuki, this is a grass greener, pretty much a turn one kill zombie deck, which had the perfect hand. We have Rugal special summoning the bear. Bro, okay, it's negated. I was going to say, there's no way that you get to just summon a barrier statue and then get negated. 8,000 attack. We're going to negate the uni zombie. We get to, to choose the attack with the 8,000 attack King of Skull Servants. Otherwise, he would have lethal at 2,400 life. Now 9,000 attack. How do we take out... That ultimate King of Skull Servants at 11,000 attack. Now it got reduced. We got double. Double 8,000. Double 9,000. Choose the attack target. You're attacking the barrier. Choose the attack target. You're attacking my Heraclinos. Anything else and I would have lost. How do we out this? We have two Geyseris. Normal summoning, the Adorix, Adorix, and the Charmer are going to make a Test Panther. Test Panther is going to activate and search for a Gladiator Beast comeback. Comeback, special summon a Gladiator from the grave, but we're not doing that yet. We're going to make, we're going to enter in the codes, Axis Code Talker, Rugal, and Test Panther. Making the Axis Code Talker, Axis Code Talker will get popping. Become 5300 attack, banish from the graveyard a Link to... Pop off the King of Skull Servants. Wipe it out. Wipe it out. Gladiator Beast, come back. Come back to me, the editor. This card is nuts. 
Summoning a guy Zerus onto the field, taking out the Link Karibo and the other monster, and just like that, Gladiator Beast in the new modern Yu-Gi-Oh era. Holy crap! Did they give Gladiators a ton of new support? The D, you have received the D you asked and you shall receive. Thank you, Alacho. Alacho just won five bucks. You could win five bucks also. If you post your spicy deck and its replays in my Discord channel for the $5 MD spicy channel right here, that's how you're going to win five bucks. Also like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video to greatly support me. This is modern gladiators and wow, if only I knew I would have played them sooner. Glider Beast Comeback, that's brand new. Special Summon a Gladiator from the Graveyard, that is nuts. The Editor continually summoning Gladiators from the extra deck onto the fields. Now, if you like this deck, I'm gonna show you another version of this deck, another way to play Gladiators. We're gonna click on any Gladiator card to go to the deck type breakdown on masterduelmeta.com. Gladiator Tri Brigade. I guess Tri Brigade is the main way to play Gladiators. Oh, what's up with that? Okay, so he was not playing with Tri Brigade, but the only real Gladiator deck type breakdown on the website is Gladiator Tri Brigade. So do consider playing it this way with Tri Brigades, or if you want to be a Chad, just play it his way, pure Gladiator, which maybe is what I would prefer to play, just to maintain the spirit of Gladiators. Thank you so much for this. This is a great deck. Loving it. Fools.